this week, RTV6 has been bringing you special reports focusing on important information about breast cancer and personal stories. Tonight, we have a look at the disease through the eyes of someone you might not expect to get breast cancer. RTV6 anchor Erica Fly has that story. Erica. Did you know it's not just women, men can also get breast cancer? According to the American Cancer Society, about 2,200 men will be diagnosed with breast cancer for the first time this year. About 400 men will die from it. I sat down with a Brownsburg man who wasn't aware men could get breast cancer until he did. And now he's on a mission to educate others. It just shocks you. You, you don't know what to do. But I don't, you know, I was just like in a daze. Three years ago, Daryl Skaggs was on an operating table having a lumpectomy. Did you ever think about a man getting breast cancer? No, in fact, uh, I was just stunned, you know. Uh, I've never heard of any man having breast cancer. His ordeal began just weeks earlier with a pain he attributed to his problematic gallbladder. But a CT scan revealed something more, a mass in his chest. He went for further testing at the Women's Center at IU West Hospital, the last place this husband, father, and grandfather thought he would be. A technician comes out and she says, uh, we're going to do a mammogram. And I said, you're what? I said, you can't be serious. <laughs> yeah. His doctor later called with a devastating diagnosis. I said, I hate to do this over the phone, but I know you want to know right away. He says breast cancer. It was stage two um, with lymph node involvement. And uh, I had a mastectomy, just like women do. Um, they took my breast and they took a couple of lymph nodes. Through surgeries, radiation, and chemo, Daryl isolated himself. Because I didn't want to hear it. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want anybody to know that I had breast cancer. It was like, you know, leave me alone. But when he recovered, he had a change of heart, deciding to instead speak out about breast cancer on a national stage. When you're wearing it, you have people ask questions too. The Ford Company selected Daryl to be a Warriors in Pink model of courage, one of 11 survivors from across the country to model apparel Ford sells to raise money for breast cancer causes and to share personal stories. And, uh, I want women to know that uh, they need to tell their husbands, their brothers, their dads, you know, everybody needs to know this. Daryl spreads the word wherever he can. When crowds of men pack downtown as Indy hosted the Super Bowl, he seized the opportunity. I just asked men, do you know you can get breast cancer? And uh, you'd be surprised the number of men that say there is no way. And I'll say, yes, there is a way. <laughs> you know, I'm living proof. If there's any kind of a symptom whatsoever, don't think that, you know, it's just a woman thing. Uh, you know, you need to have it checked out. Now take a look at some of those warning signs for men. They're almost the same as for women. Any change in the breast or nipple, including a lump, hard knot, or a thickening. An itchy, scaly sore or rash on the nipple and nipple discharge. According to the American Cancer Society, male breast cancer is not very common. For every 100 cases of breast cancer, less than one is a man. We have the story along with our other stories and more information about breast cancer on our website, theindychannel.com. Click on the lifestyle link at the top of our homepage. Todd. Good to hear him talking about it. Erica. Thank you.